all and welcome back to the sofa of adam uh, it's a little bit of a different one today won't be a video it might be one later i haven't done a recording this is a slightly different video it's on the vr headset itself and look you've got a slightly different angle because you're actually on my phone today so i'll take you with me but look hey it's all my models and things you never get to see those at some point i might actually do like a sort of video on where i live for the lulz but no my vr headset has been broken and I thought I would show you my brand new one. Isn't that snazzy? It's actually slightly different, I've noticed, to the other one. And I wanted to do a video on it. These shiny bits on the left and right of the uh, eye socket, of the lenses, they seem to be to reduce glare, and they weren't there on my last headset. Also, the reason my headset broke in the first place, my old one, and I wanted to warn you all, is this cable. This cable here is brilliant but it's non-replaceable and where it goes into the headset here just here it goes into the headset no 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 and into the screen and makes everything work this cable on the inside splays out into like a billion teeny tiny cables if that makes sense so with your constant moving with your head on oop, nearly fell over wearing it those little cables can get damaged really easily. And I'm really careful with my headset. It's on a stand normally. I mean, the box and everything is here where I've just got it and got it open and everything else. And I thought I'd go, right, well, what I should do, really, is tell everyone else what not to do. Because I wish I'd have known. So what I'm going to do is put a bit of duct tape or something, like around here, something like this, just to hold this piece of tape, or just to hold this cable up and to the headset. Because this bit here, this little clip, this little tiny thing is not exactly supporting it, see? Like, if I move it, that's supposed to catch it and stop this bit moving, but it doesn't. It just doesn't, and it broke, and I had to turn my head, and nothing happened. Other than that, look at this! If you've never seen a VR headset in its own thing, this is what it looks like when you buy it. You get a nice thing, you get an awesome box as well that you can put it in. Sits quite comfortably in there. Which is very nice indeed. Look at that. Look at how nice and snazzy that is. Ooh, I hear you all say. Ooh, I heard myself say. Comes with a nice, nice big manual. Everyone likes a big manual. We've got all the cables that you could ever need. And you get a little tiny cloth for wiping the lenses, just with all little. Don't know how well you'll be able to see it. I'll see if I can get it into focus. But it's all little X's and circles and triangles and squares. But anyway, that is basically all I wanted to say today. Just to let you all know a little bit more about the headset and things like that. If you've got any more questions, just leave them in the comments down below. Uh, hopefully I'll get some more videos up now that I've got the headset back and it's all working and alive. So thank you again for ch checking in. Leave a comment down below. Subscribe if you like. And I will see you all in the next video.